Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel again. I'm your host, Fai Moshi. I'm a vocal coach, a voice teacher, and a singer. And guys, today, by popular demand, I'm gonna be reacting and analyzing to EXO Lights Out, okay? It's an official lyric video, okay? So we were pumped up for this one, got a lot of requests for this one, and I wanna apologize for the delay, but here I am finally doing it. So once again, thank you again for all your requests, your feedback, your positivity, and all your support. Now, with that all being said, let's go ahead and react and analyze this video together. Before we get started though, if you're new here, I would really really appreciate if you go ahead and subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell because I will be uploading videos very very often for you guys. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. I would love that. I'm, as you guys know, I'm a voice teacher. I give voice lessons around the world via Skype. So if you guys are interested for voice lessons or if you guys wanted to critique your singing, then you can go ahead and check me out at Fiverr.com which I will leave a link on the description. Um, I also have a Facebook page and an Instagram account where I try to share my videos on my personal singing as well as you know me coaching other people out there, helping them with their singing and whatnot. So with that all being said, let's go ahead and jump right into this video. Ooh, that changed though. Very nice. Very nice, very nice. Okay, so first of all, the song is based in the key of A major. Okay, it's in the key of A major. Really good song. What really intrigued me was that F major chord within that A major key. So there was a little bit of A minor inflection to it, which was nice. Okay, um, I'm gonna let you know about uh, Do Kyung's vocal in a bit. Okay, let me listen to it a little bit more. So that was a tune, right? Um, so both of them are pretty much singing in this kind of breathy chest voice coordination, right? And then they were going up to an F sharp 5, getting into that breathy light mix pretty much. And they're maintaining that kind of similar uh, vocal cord compression and not getting louder per se, right? And kind of like getting into a speech like mix voice. So they're not doing that. They're keeping everything very even like, ah, right? Something like that, that kind of a coordination. Really good. Now it's Chen's turn. Let's go. Beautiful falsetto, amazing. I love that. Okay, that's that's interesting because like when he was at the top at the A4 kind of region, right, the so second passaggio area. When it came down to the first bridge area, which is roughly an F4, E4, that kind of area, he actually went to a light mix there. So he was in a falsetto at the top, and then at the bottom he was actually in a light mix and not in a falsetto. The reason why it sounded so similar is because, you know, he have, he, they all have mastered the art of vocal cord compression and vocal cord closure, so it's like they can blend, like, if I am here and then I get loud, you probably don't, <laughs> you don't probably don't hear anything like that, right? Because they can do that pretty much throughout their range, okay? So very impressive, very impressive. I really like that. Good job. So dedicated. Oof. Wow. Oh. I, that is not easy to do. Okay? It's very controlled. Even that false head, it's not like a and you kind of like push on the air and depend on the airflow. It's not that. It's very controlled. Okay? So keep that in mind. This is. These are advanced stuffs, man. It might sound like it might sound simple to some of y'all, but try singing it, and then you'll understand how difficult these things are. Okay? Wow, amazing. Nice. Look at the lyrics. Ooh. Okay, so then. When it went to the G sharp, it was kind of gearing towards some more speech like mixed voice, but it was still a light mixed voice because he was holding back. I can hear the whole, the restraint kind of quality. So that was really good. So, like, he's still not, you know, going full out per se, right? So, he's maintaining, holding back that airflow nice and even, and really maintaining that light compression, even as he's going up to G sharp 4, which is very close to the male second passaggio, okay? Really good, really good. And the lyrics of the song, I mean, 
It's, it's strong. It's really strong. I like it. Really awesome. All right, let's continue. Nice. Love that change. Wow. Nice. So that right there, that I would say is a speech like mixed voice. Okay, so now he's going for the A4 and the G sharp 4. Na, 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 na. Right? Something like that. Um, really good, really good. So now he's getting more heavier because now you know you have the chorus and whatnot. So you gotta sing a little bit louder than what you would do for the first per se, or even the pre-chorus per se, right? Really good. Wow, wow. I'm blown away, guys. Oof, ah, love that. Wow. Wow. Nice. And you know, uh, that type of vibrato that these guys are doing now, Do Hyung is singing it, um, those vibratos are actually pretty hard to do because it's a kind of fast vibrato. It's kind of like you're, you're kind of doing that on your vocal force. Does that make sense? And it's not like, ah, it's not that type of a natural floating vibrato per se. It's a little bit different, but really interesting, really interesting. So uh, Bae Kyung just sing in a mix, right? And more like a speech-like mix was where Do Kyung Soo is singing in a falsetto up there to give it a different kind of flavor rather than singing in the same mixed voice, uh, speech-like mixed voice coordination, right? So that, that was very interesting, I like it. Light mix again at the falsetto. Right? And I love that change. So it's like falsetto, light mix, light mix, light chest. Kind of like that, okay? Really awesome. Ooh, nice. I, I personally like Suho's voice quite a bit. Um, Suho's voice, like, I don't know, like, maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm being a little bit biased here, but I feel like Suho sounds a lot like Chin comparing to the other band members. Like, it's like I was literally gonna say it's Chin, but then I saw, you know, the highlight it was on Suho. I'm like, oh, no, 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 that's Suho. <laughs> so I, have, I already said this uh, in a, few, a couple of other videos that I reacted to. So um, I still want to know from you guys that whether you guys find similarities in Suho's voice with Chin's voice, or you guys feel like it's com like Suho's voice is completely different from Chin's voice. Let me know down in the comments, okay? All right, let's go ahead and continue. Nice. Wait, that's it? Oh, we good. Okay, so right now, Baekhyun is singing in the falsetto, right? You can hear that, like the right airy sound and whatnot. And all this dynamics that these guys are bringing in, that's what really, you know, gets me on or turns me on musically, right? <laughs> so, really good, really good. I'm enjoying the song so far. It's a really good song. Okay, very emotional. Let's go ahead and continue. Oh. Nice. Love that taste. Oh, wow. That kind of a thing that he just did, like kind of like a kind of like a run per se in a false coordination, that's actually not easy to do. That's actually pretty hard. And the way he executed it, that was extremely gorgeous, okay? Really beautiful. Wow, amazing. I mean, it's Chen after all, right? I mean, Chen is Chen. <laughs> I love him so much. I mean, I love every one of these guys. So, good stuff, good stuff. Let's go ahead and continue. I love that control. Wow. Wait, that's it? Oh, come on, man. Why, why, why are you going to end so early? <laughs> okay. All right, all right, all right. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Okay, okay, that's it, that's it, all right. Um, very interesting song, first of all. Very emotional, very soft and whatnot. The highest notes uh, in a mixed coordination was pretty much an A4, which is the 
literally the second bridge area for the male singers and whatnot. Um, I loved it, each and every one of their delivery of the song. Everybody brought a little bit different things to the table, which really personally intrigued me quite a bit. Um, I, li I really liked Bacon's mix uh, in this particular song because um, it was like, um, I mentioned this before a few times, is that um, there's a fine line between speech-like mixed voice and light mixed voice and Bacon was literally just singing right in that middle, like literally in between a speech-like mixed voice and a light mixed voice. So it was kind of like hard for me to first tell, hey, is he actually in a light mix or is he in a, uh, a speech-like mixed voice? Um, I'm still gonna say he's still uh, he was in a uh, speech like mixed voice because I heard a lot more chest there compared to when you know let's say Chen was singing in a mixed coordination up there. And again, um, this is not the competition of who can sing louder per se. It's all about choice. It's all about dynamics, right? So the fact that these guys can sing that lightly in a light mixed coordination up there around A4 G sharp four that 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 is very impressive because. <clears throat> It's not easy to do that. It's really not. Like for male singers, uh, the tendency is to get very loud and belt out pretty much any note above an E4, which is roughly the male first passaggio, right? So the fact that they have that control, I mean, oh my god, I mean, that's very impressive, okay? So really good song, really good song. I love the falsetto coordinations and whatnot. I love the dynamics, falsetto, light mix, light chest and whatnot. There wasn't any belting in this song, right? So no chest dominant mix voice, no belts whatsoever. Um, uh, Chen did some kind of <laughs> like that kind of fast vibrato and some kind of little trills here and there that was kind of interesting too. Another thing that really intrigued me was this, was some of the chords that was in this A major key that kind of gave you uh, uh, kind of A minor kind of vibe, right? So this song is essentially most likely based in the key. I mean, it is based in the key of A major, but it has some minor inflections to it, A minor inflections. Okay, so yeah, really good stuff, really good. Stuff. I really enjoyed it, guys, and. Um, yeah, I'm gonna ask it again. Do you guys feel like that Suho's voice sounds similar to Chen's voice or not, okay? So let me know about that down in the comments. So um, yeah, I really don't have anything else to add here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and end this video here. So there you go, guys. That's my reaction and my analysis of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction and my analysis because if you did, then don't forget to give this video a big old thumbs up, share this video with your friends and family, and if you haven't already, Go ahead and subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell because I will be uploading videos like this every single day. So make sure y'all are staying tuned for all that. Let me know down in the comments where you guys thought of my reaction and my analysis. And if you guys want me to keep on doing more extra reaction videos or any other K-pop band for that matter, then let me know down in the comments and I will try to get them back to you as soon as I can. So that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.